Today, uh, we'll be showing you how to open your Office 365 for the very first time. So you go to office.com, then you need to sign in with the Office 365 account given to you and with the default password if you haven't changed your password yet. So you're going to click that sign in button there. So in this example, we'll be using one school, one school Office 365 account. So for those schools who haven't used your, their Office 365 yet, uh, this is the way you do it. Before you go to Teams, you go first to office.com and then sign in with the account given to you. So I'll be using another account. And then in this one, I'll be using this one school in Area 5B. So as a sample, so 30, 34, 40. Two. No, 30, 34, 43, I mean, 30, 34, 43, okay, and I'll be, um, I'll be logging in with the default password that was given to them, so here it goes, I'll be changing it later on, because if the if that is the very first time you use your uh, your Office 365 account, you will be prompted to change your password immediately. But make sure to remember that password because we cannot reset that one for you. We are going to request the central office for that if that's the case. So I'll be entering the default password and sign in. Yeah, that's one. And then in that current password box, you are going to type again the default password given to you. And then in that new password and confirm password box, you're going to make your new password at least eight characters with at least capital let one capital letter, one small letter, a number, and a symbol. So that's at least eight characters, and that new password should match with that confirm password uh, box. Because if not, there will be a warning sign that will tell you that the passwords do not match with each other. So make sure all again to remember that password because if you forget that password so we cannot do something about it but instead we are going to request the Ed central office to do that for you but it will take two or three months for them to reply uh, because there have how many 42,000 schools to look into just this case like look at this case the password do not match so yeah, it will definitely tell you that you need to make sure that the password is accurately uh, matched with each other. And then do not forget that password, my dear teachers and school heads. On signing in, you have successfully now uh, changed the password that was given to you by our office. And then please, please, please do not forget that password or else, you know, it's a long journey to, again, request central office to reset that password for you. Now, this is the dashboard of your school office 365 accounts. In this case, this is from Waterloo National High School. Thank you so much for this example. So these are the applications not only word excel and powerpoint but all other applications that is within office 365 accounts of the school so this time uh, you're going to go to teams so later i will be having another video for teams and how are you going to see the depth and division plc teams bye, -bye.